Welcome back to Thunder Insider, presented by Integris Health. Then the Grinch thought of something he hadn't before. What if Christmas, he thought, doesn't come from a store? What if Christmas, perhaps, means a little bit more? Welcome back to Thunder Insider. As we visit an old favorite around this time, it's certainly one of mine, how the Grinch stole Christmas. For Ryan Gomes and Kendrick Perkins, it was the perfect thing to read at a recent reading timeout. I kept it such a secret that they didn't even know what was going on. The teachers knew, no one at the, here at the school knew, but just a few of us. And so when they came in, they were really, really, really excited, I think. They stand hand in hand and the Who's would start singing. And they sing, sing, sing. That was great. It was a fun day at East Side, uh, despite the bad weather uh, outside. Uh, Kendrick and Ryan really uh, warmed everybody up, and it's truly a blessing to have two people like that to come out and share a story with uh, with the second graders. I didn't care if it was snowing or whatever was coming through, man, just to get down here and, you know, to have kids of your own to come down and just brighten up a child day. You know, you never know what it is what children may be going through in the day. So just to make them smile or whatever and encourage them to do the right thing is always a blessing. Start with a sneer, tomorrow is Christmas, it's practically here. I think you watch the awe in the kids' uh, face and the, just the wonderment in their eyes and it, it's going to be something that they're going to remember uh, for the rest of their lives that two NBA basketball players came out and read to them and took time out of their schedule. With this coat and this hat, I look just like St. Nick. I can remember a couple of years, I probably was the Grinch myself, but it's a classic book and I think, you know, it's, going through school, everybody have to read that book, like it's just a must. You know, and I think it took it to the next level and they could pick up more books and they could learn more about sports and what these guys had to do, you know, in order to get where they are right now and, and just be really inspired by reading. Thank you. You're welcome. If you get There's a wristband in here too, man. Wow. Look at that. Ooh. All right. I already have three. Three, now you got four? And this is the least that we could do is give back. Uh, you know, I wish we, we could do more, but with the schedule that we have, we can't. So anytime we get an opportunity to give back to the fans and the community, we, we take advantage of it because the way they support us is unbelievable. You know, we got the best fans in the world. So um, anytime we get a chance to, to give back is always a blessing. Well, that does it for this week's Thunder Insider. We'll have more next week as the team continues to stay on the road for most of December. And for all the latest while they're away, just tune in to thunder.nba.com or right here to Thunder Insider. We'll see you next week on Fox Sports Oklahoma.